Hey guys, so it's Harry Styles Desert and I cannot believe I'm sitting here making this video right now because this is crazy and shocking, really exciting that I'm pregnant again and we'll start doing pregnancy videos every week and it's just, it's unbelievable. So <laughs> I don't even know where to start because we like we're going back and forth from trying not trying um should we have a third like there's just so many questions should we have a third we just enjoy the girls and have fun with them we go on fun trips and i was looking forward to doing fun stuff with them and then i was like you know i kind of i want to try for a third but then it's like it's there's so much to think about if you watch our vlogs every week you know our house is kind of small we possibly could need a bigger car so many things could change and so i just really cannot believe that we're gonna have a three babies that's crazy kinsley is gonna be six soon claire is two and then now this one they'll probably be like right about three years apart I haven't been to the doctor yet or anything i hope to go to the doctor soon I think that I'm like four to five weeks. I'm really not sure. Yeah, because we like just found out. I just told Joel and everything. We're going to wait until Kenzo till we get the ultrasound. And we're thinking about taking her to the ultrasound. We're going back and forth. We don't know. Like, I want to take her. Like, I'd love to see her reaction. See what she thinks about everything. But then, I'm like, I don't know. That should be like something special for me and Joel. But I don't know. I go back and forth all the time. I just do that in the moment and see... How that goes but i cannot wait to see it to the first ultra i love getting to the first ultrasound just checking on everything make sure everything is okay and getting to see them and make sure just everything is good and the heart rate is great and um and i did have the gestational diabetes last time so i'm already trying to eat healthier i'm gonna work out through this pregnancy i've really gotten back in shape like really i've been working really hard to get back in shape after having claire bear so, which I did after Kinsley, but I wasn't too worried about it because I knew I was going to have another one. I was like, uh, I, I did work out, but this time I was like, I got to get back in shape. So, I worked really hard, and then now I'm like, that was another reason. I was like, I don't know, because I've gotten back in shape. Do I want to go through the whole pregnancy big belly, and I know it takes a long time to get back in shape. And just and I knew with the gestational diabetes, I would have to watch what I ate, and just so much went into like thinking about, should we have another one? And so, and even to think after this one, like, it, should we have another one? It's just so crazy. Because I don't know. I don't know when we'll stop having kids. But it's like, go back and forth. And it was like, well, we, I feel like, I felt like if we didn't try, that I'd probably regret it in the future. And I was like, I do definitely want to try to have another one. I just didn't know when. Didn't know if it was going to be now or later. And because with how my business is, where I own my hair salon, it's hard to have one around the holidays because just now we just got through all the holidays and it just gets so so busy like so busy around the holidays and then around this time it kind of slows down a little bit so i was thinking about if we have one around this time next well this year no next year but surprise it's going to be this year and it's going to be um as far as what i calculated it should be in like september it's pretty much about the same as Claire, except for a month earlier. It's like the beginning of September, where Claire's just like the beginning of October. So anyways, I'm just talking. I have nothing planned to say right now. I normally keep like some notes on my phone, which I'm going to try to start doing that because I, because I don't normally keep any notes on my phone for anything <laughs> until it's time for pregnancy vlogs and baby updates and... I don't even know when we did the last update on Claire. I should probably do an update on them too soon. I should do them on their birthday. That's what I would love to do. And like ask them the kind of, those kind of cool questions. Kinsley's about to be six. So I need to do hers. Maybe I'll go ahead and do Claire's the two year old one. Because I don't know when I lasted on her. I definitely want to try to get those two videos. I have lots of videos to get to. Reviews I got to do. And trying to keep up with daily vlogs. Trying to keep up with the salon. Trying to keep up being a mom and a wife. It's just like it's crazy. So I don't know how we're going to do it, but we're going to make it work. I don't know if we're going to stay here, if we're even able to get something bigger. Um, maybe the girls will have to share a room. I don't know. We just, 
We have so much to think about now. I've even thought about having a water birth this time since if you guys want to go back and see my birth with Claire Bear, I had her naturally. It was a surprise. I wasn't planning on doing it naturally. It just was so quick. Um, I had labored here in the shower for a long time before we went to the hospital because of my previous pregnancy delivery with Kinsley, I was like, it was really long, so I didn't want to be at the hospital that long and everything, so I wanted to live here for a while. So, and it just, I felt like I was having contractions when I was in the shower, but it was like very relaxing. And then when I got to the hospital, it was so fast. Like, I just had her so quick, so I was like, of course, that just, you would think a water birth, that would just, that would just be natural to want to do that after having that experience. So, I've thought about that, but that means I'd have to be like, go to midwife and stuff, I think. I don't know, maybe you guys can tell me. I'm gonna look into it. But um, normally I just go to my regular doctors and I've never like talked to a midwife and done all that kind of thing. So I'm um, tempted to try to do that. I don't know. I'm going back and forth. We just, we really have so much to think about and tell you guys later our thoughts on that. If you have any questions, leave them below and I'll try to get to them. I'm trying to get to more comments and answering comments. Normally, I'm just so busy that I don't get to. I read them. I don't get to like answer everybody, but I try to. I'll try to get to that, but I'm just so like excited. Like I get excited and nervous. Like I'm really excited to see the girls with another little one and their reactions and like growing our family and all the fun stuff we're going to have as they grow up. But now I'm nervous just to because it's at the beginning of everything and just always nervous and ready to get to the doctor and check everything I just want to make sure the pregnancy is going good yeah this is probably getting really long and I wasn't even I was thought it was gonna be really short because I didn't have anything really to say but I wanted to shave on my belly and get a start on that I try to start taking my pregnancy weekly pictures and stuff it's just like when you start pregnancy like all this stuff starts happening and it's like just makes your life busier. But these symptoms that I can say right now is pretty much nothing. I feel fine except for my boobs are sore and that's pretty much, this is pretty much how I felt with Claire. With Kinsley, I was really sick at the beginning, which I don't know if it was because it was my first pregnancy or whatever because my pregnancy with Claire was totally different. I wasn't sick at all and, and everything was like opposite which they are opposites, they're different, and I love having two girls that are different, and they're going to grow up doing different things, they'll probably be into different stuff, and that'll be a lot of fun, and so, but now I have no, like, intuition if it's a boy or girl yet, or how I'm feeling, or anything like that, because I pretty much feel the same as when I was pregnant with Claire, I didn't really feel pregnant until, like, I started getting, my belly started getting bigger, other than that, I feel fine. So yeah, this is pretty much it. I'll show you my belly now, and hopefully I'll have more to say next week, especially when we get to the doctors. Anyway, I already have my me measure, well, I already have my measuring tape um, here. I found this when I was cleaning the toys recently. Hopefully you can see me okay. I really don't start to show till like 11, 12-ish weeks when I get in like the second trimester. So that's how I'm looking right now. Oh, this shirt will not stay up. <laughs> I need to get that another tank top one. Um, let's see. My starting point is going to be, I think it's like 28 and a half or 29. We'll just say 28 and a half right there. So that's where we'll start, guys. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I'm doing this again. This is very good. So. Pretty much it for now. So guys, I hope you guys are excited to join me on this new journey this year. Oh my gosh, I cannot believe this. It's crazy. We've been vlogging for four years. That's insane. And it's just going to be lots of fun and exciting. We're going to do pictures. We're going to do um, some professional pictures. Hopefully soon, whenever we get to doctors and all, we're going to go get some pictures made. have lots of cute ideas. I'm so excited about that. And that's pretty much it. So I'll update you guys next week if anything else is going on or just do a little update. And hopefully I can keep up with these because I'm not used to doing these kind of videos anymore. Normally just inner vlogs. Inner vlogs, so I'll probably talk a lot in it. And I can't wait to tell you guys. It's like, it's so crazy because I want to tell everybody right now. Like I told 
well obviously me and Joel knows and our best friends and that's pretty much it. We haven't really told anybody else. We're gonna wait till we do our pictures. So when I get to the doctor and announce to everybody and then tell you guys and everything. So I'm so excited to tell everybody, but it's just like, it's just like I wanna tell everybody now, but I have to wait or need to wait till we get to the doctor. So thank y'all so much for watching. Subscribe, comment, like, check out our daily vlogs. Check out her website, hairstylesouther.com, and we'll see you guys soon. Hope you have a great day, and love you guys. See you later. Bye.